Hello everyone and welcome to The Petrified King, a game created by Dan McGrath. I think I already played a game of that guy, but I'm not really sure. I decided to play this game because it vaguely reminded me of The King in Yellow. And if you've been on this channel for a while, you do know that I do like me some King in Yellow. So let's just get right into this, shall we? Let's see what all this is about. My brother is missing. He went alone on a camping trip a few days ago. We haven't heard from him in over a week. He went camping in the old forest. I must find him. Let's go and do this then. Folks around here don't journey into these woods often. Old stories of ghosts and witches. The usual. As kids, we promised our parents we would never venture into the darkness between the trees. We didn't something, I couldn't read that. I hope it wasn't important. I do like the graphics, but it, it all... It, what? It does have invisible walls. Oh, okay. So W actually really walks me forward from where I am right now. Like, it walks me the way that I'm looking. Actually, I was kind of surprised about that. I thought it would walk me towards where the camera is pointing, but it's not. It's walking me towards where I'm looking. Oh, oh, hi. Hey, what, what are you? What might you be? How do I inspect you? Not E, not space, not enter, shift. Ah, it's control, okay. What in the hell? This deer has been ripped to shreds. But by what? Do I really want to find out? Poor thing. Yeah, I'm not sure if I want to find out, honestly. This is the way that I, that I need to go. Is this the way that I came from? I'm not sure. Let's just go over here. Hello? Mr. My Brother? My Brother! Are you here? It's kind of weird that he doesn't have a name, or at least he didn't tell me his name. Brother! Is this his tent? Is this where my brother was tenting? Is this where they, where they tented to stuff? This must be my brother's camp. Yeah, I kind of thought so much. Who was he with, though? It's deserted. I can see that, yes, but also there's no dessert here. Which is kind of disappointing. I need to find him. It will be dark soon. Why did he come here? Well, I guess he just wanted to go camping. That would make sense, wouldn't it? I can't sit here. I can't sit on the wood. Ah, what do we have here? Where, where am I? Where's my character? Where am I? Ah, there I am. There's a note. October 20th, 1998. My parents used to tell me stories about this forest. Old stories about witches and ghosts and banshees. Okay. I never believed them, of course. Yeah, I also wouldn't, because banshees don't live in a forest. Those belong to Scottish royalty, if I remember correctly. If my banshee knowledge is correct. Uh, I never believed them, of course. It was until last night. I had a terrible sleep in my tent because of these shuffling noises outside probably just a Blair Witch. When I went to investigate with my flashlight, I caught sight of something dart behind the trees and run away. Is that supposed to say something dark? A dart behind the trees like it was actually like running behind the trees at very high velocity and then it ran away. It looked human. Might have been a human. At least I think it did. Right click to exit. Why would you write it on a sheet of paper? That is kinda weird. I wouldn't trust somebody who writes right click to escape on a sheet of paper. Then I would find it really hilarious if somebody went like to some sort of public transport station and write stuff like press shift to run there, press crouch to duck, like above an air vent or something. That would be hilarious. But still, kinda weird to write that on a sheet of paper. Where am I even going? What is going on here? Am I going anywhere? Is this a house over there? This looks kind of like ruins. This is actually ruins. What do we have here? Can I go here? Dude, the controls in this game are so weird. October 21st, 1998. I ventured out into the woods today to search for that thing I saw. That is a very smart idea, yes. I found some strange things. I found some old ruins of what seems like an old village. No one had been there in years, it seems. I found some strange effigies erected between some trees. Hehehe. <laughs> erected. Those didn't look old. Right click to exit. I do have a feeling that after reading one of those pages I'm gonna right click to exit and something horrible is gonna happen. I'm gonna see some shit I'm afraid. Where do I go from here? Do I go here? This, this all looks 
very familiar. This looks like where I just came from. Can I go somewhere else? Can I go back? Yes. Maybe I want to go over here. But I kind of feel like over here is where I just came from. Do I see the ruins from here? I do see the ruins from here. Okay. Well, let's take the other way then. Let's go back and all the way over here. This is odd. You would think that you're always on the left side of the screen, but that's not what's happening here. Also, it sometimes just cuts to another screen without me being on the on the other end of the screen. Oh, there's more. What do we have here? This reminds me of Pell World, honestly. Am I on Pell World Island? Probably not. There would have been some Pells here already. Oh, hi! Who are you, good sir? What is, uh... Why are you wearing a mask? Is this a mask? Can you... Can you take off your mask? This is kinda... This is scary. Right, I guess I'm leaving. I'm sorry, sir. I don't... I don't have time to play with you, I'm afraid. I think I should probably report this to the authorities. It very much looked like you just ate the human there. And we're not about this. We're not about that. I'm trying to find my brother. And I don't think you are my brother. My brother would have taken off this mask. Where am I even going? I... I can't go here, it seems. Can I go over here? Is this... Okay, I'm kind of trapped on the screen, I'm afraid. Can I go down here? I can't go down here. Well, um, that is very unfortunate. There is a guy wearing a weird mask after me. Probably, I mean, definitely eating raw flesh. Where am I? Where am I at? This is where I am. Where's that guy? I haven't seen that guy in a while. I feel like I can hear him, though. There's definitely something after me, and I do not like it. I do not like that at all. Wait, I can I can run, can I? Yeah, I can sort of run. Oh, there's more ruins, I think. No, that's trees. I do remember those trees. Why would I be able to run? That guy is not really fast enough to be after me, is he? I can just casually walk away from that guy. Why would I be able to run? And where do I go? Is this where I go? Yes. I think I... This is where I came from. Do I just have to leave the forest? Is that what I'm doing? Where do I... Ah, the deer. Yes. That is probably what he was eating before. Then this must be where I came from. Somewhere around here. This is a very weird forest. A very interesting to navigate forest. Is that where I came from? I'm kinda... I'm kinda stuck again. This seems like the place that I came from. Yes. I can't really do anything here, though. I can't go here. No way to go from there. So, uh... What am I doing? Is there anything... Oh, boy! Well, I think he got me. I think whoever that was got me. And that's the deer. Oh, I'm here now. I'm here with the deer. So if I go back here, is this death again? I can't go here anymore. Oh dear. Is there any other way that I can go? Come on, we're going over here. Controls in this game are very weird. Maybe over here? Nah, I also can't interact with anything. So, um, yes. I am here now. I am back at the beginning. Nothing here but me. Me, myself and I. Still no idea what happened to my brother. Do I... Well, I mean, I can't really go back either. At least it seems like I can't really go back. Because as soon as I walk past the deer, what happened there? This is what, uh... Oh, this doesn't kill me anymore. Okay. Is there different ways that I can go? Is there different ways that this can go? Because I don't think that's a thing. There's that letter. Yes. Oh, I can hear him. I can hear the thing that is following me. <sighs> it seems like it's not close anymore, though. Can I maybe inspect what it was that it was munching on? Is it still here? Is the masked man still here? Well, I should be there any second now. I should find out soon. This is where I found him, right? This is where I found the masked man. Oh, he's gone. What is this then? I can't... I can't find out what this is. Oh, there's another way here. Okay. Ah. More forest. Interesting. Where could he be? It's getting late. Those things. What are they? The legends were true. It's getting dark now. Ah. Well, I guess it's night time then. Do I have a flashlight? What the... Oh, and it's also raining. Okay. It's getting dark and it's raining. Oh, what is this? Is there another letter in there? 
Could you? Maybe how would how do I? Ah. Well, there's no letter here. Okay, so it must be the other thing, the other entry. Must be this hole in the wall. But I can't. Can I go here? I can't go through here. But there is something in there that I want. How would I get the thing that I want when I can't go in there? Wait, what was that? What was that? Ah, what is this? That's what I just asked. Is this some kind of altar? Those couldn't be real skulls. Could they? I mean, why not? Why would it not be? Matter of fact is there's a lot of lot of creatures out there that have a skull, so it could be either of those, I dare say. It does look like there's something in there though. Ah, there we go. Read note. October 22nd. October 22th, I guess, 1998. I went back to that village today. Something keeps drawing me back. I need to leave and head back home soon, but this village is fascinating. Today I found what seems to be a massive building or temple of some sort. I didn't go in too far out of fear of getting lost. I'm heading back to camp now, to pick up some more supplies. I want to have a look further inside. Right click to exit. So is this temple somewhere around here? Also I'm guessing this is my brother writing these. I obviously do not know, but I'm guessing that it's my brother writing these. Where am I supposed to go to? This is where I came from. So I guess I'm going that way, all the way over there, all the way over there. It's 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 all the all the way over there. That's um yes, there we go. What is this? Can I inspect or interact? No, I can't. Why is this so weird to navigate? All right, there we go. What do we have here? Is this some sort of puzzle? There seems to be a missing piece to this gate. Perhaps something could fit in this slot here. What would that be? What would that something be? I guess something green? Maybe a skull of sorts? Oh, hey, what do we have here? This looks inviting. This looks nice and cozy and comfy. Oh, there's gonna be traps here. There's no traps here. What is this? Are you are you a human? I can't inspect. I can't, okay, interesting. Well, don't mind me walking over that guy. Ah. What do we have here? October 23 question mark? It's 23rd. I did notice you're having troubles with that, but it is 23rd, so 23RD. I'm trapped. I came back to this building with supplies and had a more in-depth look around. I was checking out one of the smaller rooms when I heard a noise behind me. Next thing I knew I woke up trapped by a boulder in this room. I must have been knocked out. I can't move the boulder. I can hear something again outside the room. Okay. Oh, hello. Who might you be? Can I inspect you? Nah, no, can't inspect him from this side as well. Alrighty then. Um, but I guess the thing that I... Oh, what the hell? Okay. October 1998. They are chanting outside the room. Something in some old language. Kra. Re. Yun is what they keep saying, I think. At least, that's what it sounds like. It's getting louder now. I hope I don't die here. Well, I guess that didn't really work out for you, did it? I certainly hope I don't die here. After all, I'm the main protagonist. I have lots of stuff to do. I, I already read this, right? I'm trapped. Yes, this is that one. It's also kind of weird that the game is played exclusively with the keyboard. Except when you want to exit from reading something, you need to right-click your mouse. This is very odd. And this is also one of the earlier games from the guy who made these games. Oh, hi. Pick up skull. Yes. Oh, what am I... what am I hearing? Uh, controls! Let me out of here! There is something here. Do they all just get... oh no, they all got up. They all got up and are after me. Friggin... no! Oh no! Oh no! How do I get out? Can any of you direct me to the way outside? It's not this way. This is not the way outside. Hello. How did I even get in here? Is it here? No, it's not. This is, um... Oh, hi. No! Okay. Well, they got me. I'm afraid they got me. Press R to restart. Press escape to quit. Do I... Where do I restart? Okay, I restart the night, apparently. But I got all the intel that I need now. I just need to go back to the temple, pick up the skull, and then we should be Gucci. 
Is it over here? Yes, I have to go over here. Yeah, it's not always very easy to figure out where to go and what to do, which is the right way. But I think that might be intended. This might be as intended by the developer. Because if this is at least loosely based on the King in the Yellow, it is very much meant to drive you insane. Which definitely is a thing that is happening here. Right, I got the skulls. Do I remember the way back? I think it was just this way, right? Just following this way all the way back. I go over here, try not to get hit. Hello there, good sir. Do I go here? I think I maybe, I maybe want to go here. This is... okay. I've been walking in circles. So I guess I got that going for me, which is nice. Ah, there it is. This is where I want to go. Okay, cool. Got it. Maybe? Yes, I'm here now. Over there was the wall. Nice. And then there should be the gate on the next screen right here. Yes. Right then, let's put the skull in. And just leisurely walk into Mordor, as one does. I'm starting to go crazy. How could this be possible? The creatures. They remind me of a story our father told us once. A people who worshipped the forest hundreds of years ago. Some say they turned into something something. It would be cool if they would do a thing like right click to continue on the loading screen so you can actually read everything that the game throws at you. But no, right clicking is only for notes, not for loading. But sure. Why not? Maybe my PC is just way too powerful and it loads these pixel graphics so friggin' fast. What do we have here? October 20th, so we're going back in time now. I slept little. I am still trapped in this room. I'm running out of water and all my rations are gone. Still, still. They chant outside the room. They change from shouts to whispers now and then, but never lets up. I'm beginning to lose it, I think. Right click to exit. Yes. Yeah, I guess this is meant to be a Lovecraftian experience. Ah. Yes, let's go into a dark cave. Nothing bad ever happened in a dark cave. What would be the worst thing that could be in here? Bears? Badgers? Naked men? Is this... Can I interact with you? Are you... Are you my... My brother? This is not my brother. Alright, I guess I'll let you pray then. You do you, friend. You do you. Don't let me disturb you on your cave adventures. Your nudist cave adventures. I don't judge. I need to get out. I must get out. Kra ri run. Kra ri run. Kra ri run. They say it faster now. I think I'm losing my vision. Zari Yurtsi. Zari Yurtsi. Zari Yurtsi. What does it mean? What does it mean? Does it mean anything when you read it backwards? Is true res. No, no, it doesn't. You were our hook. No, doesn't mean anything. Well, at least I tried. I tried so hard and got so far. But it doesn't make sense, no matter how you read it. Do I have the skull still? This gate is locked. I must find... Okay. I guess I have to find another skull. And once I pick it up, there's gonna be a bunch of men, people, persons coming after me. Oh, there's another one. There's two of them even. Hi, hello. Can't interact with them. Are they all wearing masks? Are they all wearing these masks? Ah. Did I not pick up the skull or are they just not coming after me? I did pick up the skull, right? Yes. Okay. Interesting. Well, okay then. Don't mind me. I guess these cave people are not so uh, influenced, I guess, by skull magic or whatever. Right. Let's open the gate. What do we have in here? What is going on in here? Ah. Okay. Well, brother, is it you? Are you my... Are you my brother? Okay. Ah, that's a pretty big boy. And this is the petrified king. Oh no! Well, uh. Ah. Between eaves and leaves sleep the old oak trees. 
old and wise with cunning eyes, they whisper here and whisper there of witches floating in the air. Thank you for playing. Created by Dan McGrath. Made for the Haunted Payers 1 Halloween game jam. That was... that was fun. That was actually a lot of fun. I didn't really understand 100% what exactly happened here, especially not why they tried to get me for the first skull, but not the second one. But overall, it was a pretty cool game. Controls were a bit wonky, but I mean, it was made in probably a very short time for the Haunted PS1, Haunted Halloween, Haunted Game Jam haunting. So, it's totally fair. Totally fair. Considering this is a very indie game created by just one person in a really short amount of time, it was, was a lot of fun, I dare say. It wasn't as spooky as I hoped, but it was really cool. I did really enjoy it. Let me know if you liked it as well, and as always, I have been your most humble mayor of Loma Gossam. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the content that the Seed of Awesome is providing for you. Don't forget to like the video if you like it, and subscribe it to become a tourist to the Seed of Awesomeville, and don't be a stranger. Now have a good one everyone, goodbye.